Hey, Camper Rick here. It's a beautiful day. Time to get outdoors and change your backyard. Rosie, let's go camping. Today we visit Yosemite Ridge Resort. It's a collection of cabins and RV sites right next to Highway 120, a little over 12 miles from the Big Oak Flat Yosemite entrance. It's between Groveland and the Yosemite Gate. The problem is you got to get up priest grade if you're coming from the west. The left side is the real steep one, limit of 7,500 pounds. The right side, which is the new priest grade, is where most RVs and campers head up because it's a lot more gradual of a climb. You'll find this campground makes for a great base campground to see all of these things all around. There's four day trips you can take your family on. The first one being Columbia Historic State Park on the other side of Sonora. It's about an hour drive from the park, but you'll enjoy that. A second day trip, maybe even two days, is Yosemite National Park. Being at Yosemite Ridge, you're only 12 miles from the gate, so you can enjoy the valley, all the water, the falls. It's just a great, great place to visit. A third day trip would be to the high country of Yosemite. It's called Tuolumne Meadows, and there's some scenery there you'll never see in the valley. Just beautiful. Another fun day trip would be to the Moccasin Creek Fish Hatchery. You simply head back west from the campground, down Priest Grade, and it's down at the bottom of the hill. It's a great place to bring your family to visit. We're open daily from 7.30 to 3.30. You can come feed the fish. When you get to the resort, Big Buck's gonna welcome you. You'll notice a row of gas pumps, they sell diesel, propane, and gas, and of course, a compact convenience store in case you need things while you're there. Hi, my name is Joe McGrath. I'm the owner of Yosemite Ridge Resort. We're close to Yosemite is the biggest draw. We're only 12 miles to the gate, about 15 minutes. And we're a small, relatively small, quiet park. The resort is host to several cabins and cottages. The cabins are so comfortable. It's just like being at home. You have everything you need. It's the perfect place to bring your friends for a weekend in Yosemite, even if they don't have an RV or tent. You'll notice the accommodations will be clean, very spacious, and comfortable. This is our RV section. We've got 15 full hookup sites, 30, 50 amp. All but two of them will accommodate 35 foot and above. This is one of our large pull-through sites, site number nine. And you can see it's surrounded by grass, as are all the other sites. And trust me, the other sites are beautiful. In fact, they mix the RV sites with some of the cabins or cottages, so if your friends are coming with you, they can stay nearby. You'll also notice there's a great playground for the kids and tetherball. This is our restaurant, Buck Meadows Restaurant. It's next door. It's about a five-minute walk or a 30-second drive if you want to drive up. And if you get tired of the campfire cooking after a day or two, this is a good spot to come. Inside, you'll find comfortable counter and dining room seating, a private room for groups and clubs, and an attached bar area for evening fun. My name's Lita Rolls. Our food is excellent. It's all homemade. We have um, Jack's favorite and Joe's favorite. Also, our burgers are the bomb. For you golfers, there's Pine Mountain Lake Golf Course out of Groveland. It's an 18-hole, 6382-yard, open year-round, par 70 championship course. There's enough trees, they say, to make you wish you had a chainsaw as your 14th club. And of course, they've got a small but efficient pro shop and a very nice, fun 19th hole. The Iron Door Saloon was built sometime before 1852 and is the oldest in California. In addition to this, some stray bullet holes, there's lots of history and live music plays every weekend of the year. The water's cold in early spring and perfect for fishermen, but in the summertime, boy, this is a great natural place to go swimming. It's just four miles east of the resort. That pretty much sums it up on why you want to come stay at Yosemite Ridge Resort. Hey, join me, Camper Rick, every Wednesday for Weekend Warrior Campground Review. Don't forget to check out this month's featured destination. Hey, let's go camping! Yes, Tom!